Assalamualaikum everyone. I welcome you all to my channel that is Meroz Z. Well, today's video is all about what I have learned in 2018. So there are five things. Actually, I have learned a lot. Both could seek hai. Lekin main aapko sirf panch cheeze bataungi jo maine 2018 mein seeki hai. So here it goes. First thing is sometimes you need to fake out your emotions now what do i mean by that iska ye bilkul matlab nahi hai ki if you don't like the other person and you tell him or her that you like him just because you can't really fake out your emotions no that doesn't really mean that what i mean by faking your emotions is sometimes aap ek aise situation mein hote hain where you can't really show your emotions like if you're really sad you don't want the other person to know that you're sad right what you do then is you fake out your emotions you try being happy you try laughing out you try you know, uh, getting along with people, that is what you do, right? But if you're in a sad situation and you got really happy, Mata, for example, you just passed your exam or you're really happy about your assignment or your job or anything, okay? And you have a sad situation, mein. for example, there's an accident. You, you're sad, obviously, by looking at that, but you don't want to show that happiness as well, okay? You're excited, you're everything, but you don't want to show that excitement or happiness. Now what you do is you need to fake out your emotions, right? So what I have learned in 2018 is that sometimes, kabi kabi, <coughs> sorry, kabi kabi, you need to fake out your emotions uh, according to the situation. Okay? Kabi kabi, such situation aata hai that you do not want other people to know what's happening in your life. So that is when you actually fake out your emotions. So you know, try it out, and it's not that bad. Ye nahi ki aap kisi aur ka dil dukhaye, lekin apne aap ko khushi dene ke liye you need to do that sometimes, right? So the second thing is, second thing is that once in your lifetime you need to travel all alone. Matlab alone ka matlab ye hai ki you can either go with a group of people who are actually strangers to you or you can go alone for two to three days, for two to three days without anyone, right? All alone, all by yourself. Now isse kya hota hai? Isse you get to explore yourself a lot. Jab aap akele jaate ho na, you get to learn a lot of things about yourself jo aapko pata bhi nahi thi ki you can actually bear, okay? So I'll tell you a thing. Mujhe height se bohut dar lagta hai, okay? And I went all alone to Skardu with a group of people who were actually strangers to me. Mujhe height se itna dar lagta hai ki I can't even climb the bus wali jagah nahi hoti. Bus ke upar jo humne roof pe baithna hota hai, I can't even climb that, okay? I was that scared of heights. Well, when I went to Skardu, there were people and you know we were going on the top of the bus. So I was like, let's try it out. I didn't tell anyone that I was actually very scared of it, but somehow I managed to do it and I overcame it. And you know, I got to understand that sometimes when you're all alone, you can overcome your fears because you're all alone, you have no other way, you have no support and you have only you, yourself, and that is when you actually overcome your fears. So that is the second point and I've learned a lot about myself going on this trip all alone and uh, you know if you get a chance to go all alone even though if you don't have a chance you have to make a chance to go all alone once in a lifetime you know just once try it go all alone with a couple of strangers and you'll see what the difference is now the third thing is never ever let your emotions fade out now what do i mean by that logo ke zindagi mein bad experience hota hai okay but having two to three bad experiences doesn't have to mean that you have to fade your emotions away. I know it is affecting you. I know it will affect you. I know it can affect you. But what you need to do is do not let your emotions fade away. Emotions this time pe kam ho sakte hai, okay? Us time pe kuch logo ke liye you can't really show emotions. You can't be that happy. You can't be that sad. You can't really tell people what happened. But with time, you have to let it go. I know it's very hard. I know it, it takes time. But do not let this affect you like as a whole because you do not have to fade your emotions away. Your emotions are worth a lot. They're, not, they're just not based on bad experiences. Your emotions of happiness, joy, pleasure, so many things. They come when you actually value those emotions. So don't let them go. I know it's hard. It will affect you, but don't let them fade away. Your parents, your loved one, your family, your friends, everyone needs your emotions. So do not let them fade away. You know, like hold tight on your emotions. Your emotions might be your best friend like one day. So, you know, let your emotions flow out. Let your emotions tell people your story, your life story. Fourth thing that I've learned is start giving time to the people who actually matter. Now, you know, there's so many people 
I like if I talk about myself, I've actually limited my friend zone a lot. Why? Because I want to give time to the people who actually matter in my life, who don't really matter in my life. I'm not ignoring them, but I'm not just giving them my presence, my attention, my time. Why? Because I want to give the most of my time, whichever I have, because life is this small. So whatever time I have right now, I want to give it to the people who really matter in my life, who are there for me, who I know will support me, you know. Those are the people who actually need your time, presence, importance, everything. So start valuing those people start giving your time to the people who actually matter who are actually there even when you're in a bad situation in your worst time they're there for you so give them their attention give them your support give them your presence they need it okay fifth thing that i've learned is start being kind well jab main choti thi na when i was in my school nobody actually taught me kindness hoti kya i never knew ki kindness mein you know karte kya hai but i sta sta when i grew up i got to understand ki acha you know people expect me to be kind but i don't really know what kindness is right i started studying about it now at this stage kindness for me is not just you know helping others it's not about doing small things for others but kindness is like somebody else is saying really bad words to you for example he or she is really angry at you and they're being really harsh on you and they're saying so much bad about you so much bad that you can't even bear it okay but you are calm you are there for them you support them now that is the most important thing you tell them that no matter what i am there to support you no matter what no matter what you are there to support them no matter what whatever they do you will stick to them like a glue now that is what kindness is even though they're harsh you're still there to help them out you're still there to support them this is the true kindness you can find around you yes help strangers do little things for people and you know kindness is actually little things but its value is a really big one so start being kind to random people start passing a smile like not to strangers who are passing by a street that's very awkward but start passing smile to your parents you know to your friends to the people who actually matter or you know if if there's a beggar and he or she is very sad pass him a smile that might help them right So let's all be kind and hold hands and tell each other that kindness is the best thing we can do in this world because you know we need to make this world a better place not just for us not just for you like for everyone around us. So yeah, these are the five little things that I have learned in 2018. I've learned a lot like in ye panch gini chini cheeze thi and I hope you have learned some of them. You know agar aapne koi inme se cheez seekhi hogi do let me know in the comments below and agar aapne kuch naya seekha hai do let me know in the comments below as well because I want to learn more and I want to learn ki aap logon ne kya seekha. Happy holidays and best of luck for your coming year. I hope it brings you all the blessings and all the things that you need and whatever you want in your life you get that in 2019. And yeah because you have a very special smile. Keep smiling, keep loving yourself. Tell everyone that kindness starts from within, from yourself. So start being kind to yourself and you will be kind to others as soon as possible. Keep smiling and see you in the next video. Happy holidays. Bye bye.